digital update is brought to you by West Medical. I'm Tori Cooper. Here are some stories making headlines locally. The community gathering last night to welcome home a group of our local veterans as Honor Flight 40 returned. From family and friends to local leaders like Mayor Karen Goh, an ecstatic group of over 100 waited to welcome the veterans home from Washington, D.C. The mission of the Honor Flight Network is to take veterans to Washington, D.C. to visit memorials and more. The group that returned home last night was part of Honor Flight 40, made up of 17 veterans. Overwhelming. I, I would really like to thank the people of Bakersfield for bringing out in this homecoming. This, this is amazing. This whole trip has been amazing. It's been overwhelming from the get-go. And I really appreciate all the support that we're getting. Thank you, Bakersfield. I'm going to hug him. I'm going to say thank you. And then I'm going to go up to other people and say thank you. Honor Flight Kern County says their next trip will be next month when they take 100 Vietnam veterans to D.C. After a bus crash left one member of his crew dead, Josh Turner will not be playing at the Kern County Fair tomorrow. Now the fair is announcing musician Phil Vassar will take his place. Vassar will perform tomorrow night on the Budweiser Pavilion stage. Vassar made his debut in the country music scene in the late 1990s. He's known for songs like Just Another Day in Paradise, Little Red Rodeo, and Six Pack Summer. Vassar is scheduled to perform beginning at 8. And it looks like if you're headed out to the concert, you will have a little bit of a warmer condition. Warmer conditions tonight, but tomorrow those conditions are going to be cooling down. It's absolutely beautiful for that concert. But let's take a look at those highs we can expect throughout the day here in Bakersfield. Well, we're going to be topping out in the low 90s, so that's well above average for this time of year. We are tracking that warming trend over in our mountain community. 79 expected in Fraser Park, 80 in Tehachapi, 89 up in Lake Isabella and out in our desert cities, upper 80s, low 90s out there. Now, if you are headed to the Kern County Fair later on tonight, those temperatures cooling to the mid 80s by about 8 p.m., cooling down even more later in the night to the low 80s. So it'll be a beautiful one. And those temperatures are going to be on somewhat of a roller coaster this week. So we're warm today. We're going to be cooling back down tomorrow for the first day of fall. But then that warm up bringing those upper 90s potentially by Wednesday. But we are cooling back down by the end of the week. Take a look at Saturday low 70s potentially, but we are tracking that slight chance of rain as well. That's a look at what's making headlines at this hour. We will have another update for you later today.